This installation of the MP Server Series is all about assembly. Welcome back to our MP Server Series. My name is Joe from MetroPhotog.com. Make sure you check out the site, all the other stuff that we do, most importantly our photography. Uh, this installation number six I believe for our server series it's all going to be about assembling our server if you haven't watched videos previously where we talk about picking your parts for your server from the case through your motherboard processor RAM if you need a video card uh, your storage and how you're going to choose that and then also your power supply requirements make sure you go back and watch those videos in the playlist I'll put a link in the description so again thank you so much for coming back we're going to get right started in assembling our server so I hope you enjoy all right, so we're going to get started. I have the uh, GoPro Hero 3 Black Edition. If you haven't seen our video unboxing and stuff like that on this, uh, check out the channel um, there. The first thing I'm going to do, and the first thing I like to do, is to prep my motherboard before going in the case. And this is what I do for any PC build. Um, so I'm just going to actually unbox this real quick. So now we have motherboard processor RAM. And what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take this guy and put him on the side. I have that done. Now I'm going to prep my case, which is going to be pretty simple, I think. And so I've already unscrewed these drive carriers. We'll put the drives in the carriers. Uh, before I do that, I want to take these fans out. I've got these wires that I've already ran through here, but I gotta take this guy out and put my DVD drive in.
All right, so now that I have my um, optical drive in here, I've got my front case fans, my rear case fans installed, got all that set up. The next thing that I want to do is I want to install my power supply. Now, usually what I would do is I would install the motherboard here, but I'm going to install the power supply. And the primary reason is that I have a cable that I want to run underneath the motherboard, which is the... Uh, four pin power. So I'm going to do that. Again, we're going to be putting in our motherboard right now. Uh, I've got my motherboard in the case. I'm just going to pop it out real quick. Install my IO shield in here. Just pretty easy. You just pop it in there. And then I'm just going to take my motherboard and slide it in here. Nice and easy. Alright, so I've got my front panel uh, connector set up, USB connector set up, power supply in, optical drive, all my case fans, my motherboard processor and RAM are in, and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to work on my drive carriers because I need to get my drive carriers in to finish. Um, my drive carriers, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, they come with two carriers that sit in the front here, and so on one of them I'm going to put my two um, hard disk drives see if you can see them here with the light hard disk drives and then the other one I'll put my one SSD
Alright, so that's the end. I've put in the uh, board processor RAM as you saw before. I put in our power supply unit, optical drive, two drive sleds, one with two two terabyte drives and the other one with um, one SSD that I'm going to be using for the boot drive on this. Uh, I've got everything in the case. Everything's got power. Uh, I did have a little bit of a problem with the hard drives touching the RAM. That's why they're over here on this side now. And I just got to make sure everything else is good. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to be uh, hooking this thing up to power and checking to make sure that everything's running the right way. And then we'll hook it up and do a first post. So that is it for our, our assembly video. Thank you so much for watching. So this video is all about assembling our Soho server. Thank you so much for watching. If this video helped you out in any way, please click the like button down below. In the description below, we also have all of our social links. Please make sure you're following us there so you can see when new content comes out. Check out www.metrophotog.com for more technology and, and photography related content there as well as you can see our most important work which is our photography. Thank you so much again for watching. Um, make sure you go back and watch any other other videos in the server series if you haven't done so already. If you have a, a, a comment, question, anything about this video make sure you put it in the comments below and if you'd like to ask us any other question again as always over on our site metrophotog.com slash contact you can fill out the form there and they'll send uh, a message right to our inbox. Thanks again so much for watching we'll see you in the next video.